What's going on everybody? DJ Goham here. Welcome back to the channel. Today, Giant Software released the cinematic trailer for Farming Simulator 22. This is the video that's going to play once you load up your game and is representative of some of the features that will be available for the next game. Remember that this is just the cinematic trailer, not the gameplay trailer. That out of the way, let's take a look. A wise man once said, to forget how to dig the soil, to end the earth, is to forget ourselves. Well, maybe some have, but a few of us still know. You gotta be willing to put in the time, make the sacrifices, and the hard choices. The job's got its perks, don't get me wrong. The sweet smell of the morning dew, the way the warm sun and the cool breeze can dance across your skin. But don't think it's a game. The farm's got a way of sorting the wheat from the chaff. Just remember to keep your wits about you. You fall, you get back up again. Cause this is more than just a job. It's a calling. Who else would choose to wake up early in the morning, tear up their hands working in the fields all day, and then spend the evening planning how they're gonna do it all over again? Better tomorrow. Day after day. Season after season. Year after year. That's a calling that's never ending. It stretches far forward and back from us as long as farmers have been tending this earth. And farmers will be around as long as such a thing exists. Tomorrow is secured by those willing to dirty their hands today. So when you feel alone out there in the field, just remember you're not. Think about all those that have come before you. And all those that'll follow. Plant today. Harvest tomorrow. Okay, wow. There is lots to unpack here, but let's start with the release date. November 22nd, 2021. That is a Monday, and it is the week of Thanksgiving here in the States, just in time for the holiday season. It will be available on PC, Mac, PlayStation 4, PlayStation 5, Xbox One, Xbox Series X, Xbox Series S, and even Google Stadia. We also saw lots of tractors and equipment starting from the very beginning. We've got what looks to be an older Ford-style truck on the left with an SUV or something like that on the right, but it is hidden behind the windmill and some trees. We've also got a tractor in between them, though that could be the Massey Ferguson 5. S that's shown off a lot in the video. Next, we get the star of the show, the Fent MT 1100 series with the father of the farm. This is a tractor that we had in Farm Sim 19, so nothing new here. Next, we see the daughter pull up in a Massey Bergeson 5S, what we talked about earlier. It's a brand new tractor for Massey and beginning its digital debut for Farming Simulator 22. One thing that we do see are some vehicles, though I'm not sure we're going to be getting any of these as they are not the main focus and none of them are branded from like one of them maybe. Uh, though from the front to the back, it is easy to pick these out. We've got Honda Accord, Ford F-150, which almost looks like it says Ford on the back. You got a Buick SUV of some sort, a Volkswagen Jetta, and one more car in the back that I can't figure out. I will say that Ford F-150 is very much so like the real life variant, and it kind of looks like the truck from the very beginning. Just saying. We don't see another new vehicle for a while in the video, though I just want to point out the pickup truck here again. <laughs> you can't tell what it is, but I just want to point out that every single vehicle that I can in this video. You can also see what looks to be the Massey 5S parked on the left hand side in the barn as well. Here we go. We've got the Case IH Magnum with US flashers and skinny duels, one of my favorite setups, pulling a Kenzie planter. 
I know lots of you are going to be real hyped to see this, and I hope you weren't worried about combines. We got one of those too. The John Deere X9 is confirmed for Farming Simulator 22 as a base game machine, which also opens up for modders to use, which I think is going to be a very popular place to start with. It's also running a John Deere corn header, but I'm not really sure which one it is. When you harvest, you need to move that crop, and our next vehicle is doing just that. This is an older semi truck and looks very lifelike. Holy cow. I'm not sure if this is a lizard or a branded truck, but I'm sure you guys know. Guys, what is this? Something new that I'm sure you guys are going to be happy to see is a new crop, grapes. These will be getting a new harvesting machine as well. The New Holland Broad 9070L, which we get a great look at here. We have something extremely similar to this as a mod for FarmSim 19 already. Yet again, the Fent 1100 gets another look here. It's like the fourth or fifth time we've seen it here. Showing the grapes in the shed. They have been very heavy handed with the 1100 and grapes in this video. Did somebody say Massey 5S again? But this time with a snowplow, evidently they did because that's exactly what we're getting. This snowplow does have a three point attachment, so we're gonna be able to use it with anything that we want. And that's great news. And the last show of vehicles and equipment that we get to see is right here with the Fent 1100 again, pulling what appears to be a Cokerling cultivator, something very similar to that in the snow. This picture is absolutely stunning. With the vehicles out of the way, let's take a look at a few screenshots that stood out to me and might be holding something bigger or the key to something in the video. Let's take a look at right here first, the first screenshot with the older Ford possibly at the bottom. Here it says, a game by Giant Software. You may or may not know, but Giants are publishing this game themselves. There is no focus home entertainment here. It is all Giants. Fast forward to the pick with the cars, we could also see that there is a cattle crossing sign in the middle with cattle on the left hand side and right hand side of the road. There's adult cows and little baby cows, so there's a chance that we could possibly be getting baby cattle in the game. This is a smaller single lane road too, so maybe we're going to see more country dirt roads and paved ones in this game. This screenshot here is very interesting. We've got the corn, but it looks like a UFO or something has come through and just started making crop circles. The stalks are all pushed down, looks like somebody just ran straight through here. This is by far the most puzzling part of the entire announcement today. You have any idea what's going on here? What am I missing? Did somebody say wheat seeds? Well, there's a chance that they could have. And here's a bag that clearly says wheat on the very front. I know lots of you, myself included, have wanted different seeds for different crops forever now. So maybe we're finally getting it. The only thing is this feature is generally safe for mods and PC only mods. So we're just going to have to wait and see if it comes true. Grapes are a huge part of the modding community right now with lots of mod maps supporting them and a handful of machines to tend them. And grapes will be returning in Farming Simulator 22, but in a different way by being included base game. We only know of one machine right now that's going to be doing the harvesting for us, New Holland Brawl, uh, but having grapes as a base game product will give us even more options for the production chains as well. Thinking wine, things like that, though, not really sure if that's going to fly because of the topic and the rating that the game has, but we will see. This is one that I'm sure lots of you have picked up on the text message on the cell phone. I can't count how many of you guys have asked for cell phones in game. I don't know why, but hey, here's your teaser. It's part of the company J Mobile, probably play on T-Mobile. It's 8 a.m. and evidently Sophia, the daughter, is almost doing whatever she's doing. And she's probably snow plowing because it's exactly what the next screenshot is that we see. Making way for some seriously overpowered Fent 1100 action to go out in the snow. Snow plowing, base game, let's go. And we end right here with the father and daughter cultivating up the land in the snow. Something that we could do now, but doesn't look half this good, even, even in the way it is right now. This is also being done in a way that workers wouldn't be smart enough to comprehend either, at least in Farm Sim 19. Doing this in strips to come back and do in between on their way back through. With everything that we've seen so far with Farm Sim 22, I'm getting more and more excited about the release every day at Farming Simulator 22. And November 22nd can't get here quick enough, but that is it. That is everything new and current that we have right now on Farm Sim 22. Remember that this was only the cinematic trailer. This is not a gameplay trailer. We'll get that eventually. This is only to tease us and show off some features of the new game. And of course, to get us all hyped up. I think it worked very, very well. If you have any questions about this, please feel free to post them down in the comment section below. And let's get the conversation started. If you noticed anything in this video or in these screenshots that I failed to mention, please, please, please feel free to post those down in the comment section below. And let's find every little detail in this video. Nothing is going to be missed today. If you enjoyed this video that I've made today, please make sure you drop a like on it. Get subscribed to the channel if you are new and join the GoHam fam. Make sure those notification bells are on as well so that you never miss any Farming Simulator 22 content at daily Farming Simulator videos here on the channel.
All being said, hope you have a great day. We'll see you later. Peace.